Right now they got the down for sound truck over here. And this thing is fucking loud. Deb, you gonna do it? What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog and welcome to the inside of Devin's car that is finally running. How's it feel to finally be able to drive this bitch after like a month and a half? It, it feels awesome. Are you in shock right now? Kind Devin like doesn't even know what to do right now. He just wants to go fast, but uh, not until my shit with all the courts is taken care of. Right now we're swinging by the gas station, scooping up some gas really quick, and then we are gonna head out to Las Vegas Speedway. There is, it's called Import Face Off, right Dev? Yeah. There's like this huge car show going on. It's called Import Face Off. As I just said to you guys, sometimes I like to repeat myself just to make sure that you guys caught that. But it is so nice today. They could not have picked a better day to do this car show. It's 85 degrees, sun is shining, and this Las Vegas weather just keeps getting better and better. So I'm super excited to see all the nice cars out today. Hopefully there's a ton of people there. And I haven't eaten yet today, so I am definitely hoping they have some food and a bottle of water so my fat ass doesn't get dehydrated. And before we get any too much further into this vlog, I wanna thank you guys for all the positive comments on yesterday's vlog. You guys just showed so much support with my little rant that I was discussing about like the negative comments and stuff like that. And all of you guys, you know, gave me that positive reinforcement that I've been needing from you guys to keep me going and wanna keep vlogging. And I just, I cannot thank you guys enough for that. So to everyone who commented something positive on yesterday's vlog, thank you so much. We just got to import face off. I do apologize, right now we're in the car and it is still kind of windy. There's a ton of people out here so i think what we're gonna do we paid to park inside so we're gonna park and then we're gonna do walking around and my fat ass is gonna find some food are they doing races today too dev oh this is gonna be fucking sick damn this will make up for not coming to midnight mayhem friday night looks like there's just a bunch of civic <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, I would get smoked by these fucking Civics. <laughs> CRX. But these shits are completely fucking gutted. They weigh like 10 pounds. Shooting some smoke. Damn, that was so fucking close. 11.600 and 11.601. Damn. the gear there <laughs> is there anything other than civics all i've seen are civics and it's just a bunch of hondas oh there's a buggy I don't know. I think this one's going to be close. I think it's going to be really close. That Civic's probably going to grab way quicker than that buggy does. Holy! Yeah, that buggy got him. Well, oh! Oh, he got him. He did get him, but the buggy, I don't know. The buggy seemed like it was, he was way ahead. The buggy uh, did jump sooner, though. Right now, they got the down for sound truck over here, <laughs> and this thing is fucking loud. Deb, you gonna do it? Bring the camera with no, you. No, there's a reason why they're telling me to do it. Bring the camera with you. I ain't going in there. sucks you up. Yeah? Have you been to something loud before? I used to have a 12 inch FI. Uh, well, get down in there if you want. God. It hurts. Yeah? Bad. Real bad. Don't bail out. It don't You ready, man?
Yeah, it's kind of loud. <laughs> now I'm gonna show you guys what it's like from the outside, because you probably could not hear shit while Devin was in there. This guy's hat's about to blow off. Look at the fucking door. Have if you had to guess, how many amps are in there? 12? 12. 12. They even got like a little portable dyno out here. This is pretty sick. They got a SRT4 Neon up there right now. They're about to start the dyno on this SRT4 really quick. Took them a while to get everything set up, but they should be ready to go now. What had happened was he was stepping on the gas. The front end was swaying, but it's pretty good now. didn't want to say anything until we walked away but uh that guy's srt4 only dynoed at 193 but it is hot they don't have the proper you know dyno temperature they don't have the proper dyno fans but I, I was way off i was way off that car sounded it sounds really really good and he said he was pushing like 16 pounds of boost uh and i don't know just must not be the weather this autofocus is trash right now but right now we're gonna head back out to the drag strip see what cars are racing now hopefully it's not any more hondas and we walk out and they got a benz versus a civic so i'm interested to see how this turns out i guess a gtr just ran versus a civic definitely interested to see how this turns out I get it. Got him too. Final call, car two. Wow. That is a fast fucking Civic. I don't, I don't say it often. Oh, oh, easy there, killer. Missing a couple gears or what? That dude, that was a 10.5 second fucking Civic. That is stupid. New versus old. Let's see what happens here. Oh, not really new, but kind of new versus kind of old. <laughs> 10 second Civic, I don't get it, makes no sense. They got a girl on a bike right now that's about to run. See how fast this bike is. two seconds at 150 miles an hour i do not like the look of that bike i do not know that shit is just so damn ugly i do not like that Nine point two seconds. Please tell me you saw that chain almost fucking snap. That shit almost fucking snapped. Right now we're getting ready to leave the car show. I'm just gonna give you guys a little walkthrough, show you guys what's here. There's really not that much because it was excess car night in Cali this weekend, so mostly everyone's there. But I'm just gonna give you guys like a little walkthrough, show you some of the stuff. You guys can still hear all the civics racing and shit and i know some of you don't care for the car stuff so i'll put like a little warning if you don't want to watch the car stuff just jump to whatever time it is in the vlog when i figure out where i'm at after i'm done editing it and they have a couple cars over there nothing too crazy devin's over here taking pictures of the gtr oh fuck Dev, there's no way I can record it. Anyways, uh, I'm just sorry if you guys are like freaking out because the camera's going crazy. I'm trying to hold this steady. There's like a fucking dead animal underneath this guy's fucking car that's just hanging on. It's fucking gross. And then Devin's trying to race this other E90 right here. Dad, let me see your twerk. 
twerk, 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 team, twerk, team, twerk it, twerk it, twerk it, twerk it, twerk it. Damn, you better than most of these girls out here. Yes, I am. I fucking hate you. I fucking hate you. So it's been a pretty eventful day right now. Devin is gonna do the last and final steps of his car, and that's putting his engine cover back on. I, can you handle this one by your dolo? I don't know. By yourself? By your solo? This is difficult. I think you got it. You going? Yeah. <laughs> so, Nate is fucking wrapped around the headset and... Or Cody's headset. We don't know how. Like, what happened, bro? What happened? Alright, hold on, guys. He was, like, really stuck in here. Like, it was wrapped... Not only was, like... The headphones part wrapped around him, but the cord was like wrapped around his back feet. Like, I don't know what he did. I've mentioned this in the live stream before that when I normally would never have my snaps open and then I open it and a ton of people messaged me streaks and I didn't know what it meant. I always thought streaks meant like send nudes or some shit. Fucking Devin thought that people were calling him streaks because he looks like shit. <laughs> I'm fucking dead. He was like, yo, when people used to message me streaks, I thought they were calling me streaks, like shit streaks. And I just fucking lost it. That is the funniest thing I've ever heard. Well, guys, I have some good news. My warrants have finally been lifted. Uh, everything is taken care of until the 13th. And then I'm going to figure out, you know, my fines for the lower tickets that the judge issued me. I'm just so happy I can finally leave the house and drive my car. I actually just headed over and dropped off my front bumper and my M-Tech uh, side skirts as well to get painted. So hopefully those will be done here shortly. And trust me, my radar is just fucking, it's staying on. So we just got home not too long ago and Devin is getting everything ready for his second interview today with the state. So please wish him luck. I really hope he gets this job. I do apologize for all that annoying ass noise with my radar. But from here on out, I refuse to turn it down because every time I've gotten pulled over, I turn it down and I forget to turn it back off. And that's every single time I've gotten pulled over. Literally every single time since I've been in Las Vegas, it's because I'm recording. I turn my radar off so you guys don't have to hear that beep and then I just forget to turn it back on. But anyways, with that being said, that is pretty much going to wrap it up for this vlog. I still have a few running around to do today uh, since I can finally fucking drive again and leave the house. I have to run to the bank, run a couple other errands. So once again, that is going to wrap it up for this vlog. Thank you guys again for all the positive comments on yesterday's vlog. Please leave positive comments. The positive reinforcement is really working. I can tell you guys that much. If you did enjoy this vlog, please give it a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate Appreciate it to everyone new watching this channel uh, please hit that subscribe button I would really really appreciate it also make sure you turn on my post notifications so you guys never miss a new video and I will see you guys tomorrow it brings it